All right, I got the mail today and got a few things here. Thought I'd go through them and show you. A few more crankbaits I've been buying. So I've already kind of popped this open just to save time. In a Ziploc bag. And this is a pretty sweet wiggle wart. Pretty Rapala. This is one of the Bass Pro Shops suspending suspending wiggle warts. I don't know which uh, which one this is, but um, really nice one. Put that here. I gotta look them up and see because I can't remember some of the numbers. There's another nice bubble wrap job. I uh, know this one. This is a V37. Brown crawdad. It's good looking. This one's in pretty good shape. The brown crawdad has a black back. Yellow eyes. Nice crawdad pattern and then a red belly. So Another great bait. Let's see what this one is. I think this might be another. One of these is probably a flat A. I think I got one more flat A, bomber flat A coming. And <clears throat> rattles. In there. This is in a Walmart bag with rubber bands. All right. Okay. This is a red head, or an orange head. It's actually an orange. This one is definitely a fisher, meaning it has been fished. It's pretty obvious. Not super clean, but that's okay. I will fish it some. Yellow eyes. So, three very different Wiggle warts, pretty good looking baits. I like I like my wiggle warts. This last one, it's too flat to be a wiggle wart, so it's got to be a flat A. I haven't ordered any other crank baits that I know of. Some of these are. I want to open. Good, good cold water baits, all these, if you're fishing. And you know there's, yeah, this is a flat A. Wrapped in a little bubble wrap. Don't know how many more of these I'm gonna order these flat A's. I just wanted some for winter time coming up. Not bad. Great, uh, great baits though. These wiggle warts. You can never go wrong with a wiggle wart. Wonder about these though. I know in some conditions these will catch them too, but. It's amazing when you look at all the colors that are made. At some point you realize 
they're just adding different varieties not really to catch fish but to sell baits because some of these things are just never really gonna be everyday fishers and that's kind of kind of what I think about something like this now somebody will say oh, well I've caught my best fish on that and maybe it's true but overall day in and day out this is what you need for fishing not this see ya